Hey guys, welcome back to another video. I missed you all so much. I haven't sat down and vlogged in a while, so if I am a little bit awkward, it's because I literally have not picked up a camera and spoken to it in so many days. But hello, I am here. And I know I told you guys on Instagram that I was going to be filming a an updated tattoo tour. I asked you guys if you had any questions for me and things that you wanted me to answer in that video but I haven't had the chance to sit down and film that yet. And the other video that I'm currently working on is a week of workouts. So it's basically like what goes on in a week. What my workouts look like. Basically it's just like a little peek into what I do weekly. It does change because I follow a program, so every week it could be different. I am still currently working on that. It's like four hours long because of the time lapse and stuff. So I have no idea how I'm going to be addressing that or how to edit that. So that's why I'm so tagalan. So I hope you guys understand and I'm really sorry for the delay. Today, I decided to just sit down and speak to you guys because I think that's easier to edit because it's like sit down vlog lang. I don't know how many days this vlog is going to be but enjoy while i'm here i've been going a little bit crazy with my purchases this month and last month not even gonna lie i placed an order on Chien for like seven orders six orders so i think i'm gonna be doing a collective haul but for now let me just show you some of the recent items that i bought that aren't like clothing pieces or anything like that so starting off this company reached out to me and asked me if i would like to receive an item from their website and I said sure and I'm just gonna test it out <sighs> that I would just test it out and see if I would like it so this is from Bow Today and I'm very surprised because this is the first time I've heard of Bow Today I did do a little bit of research and I saw that they had really good reviews like non-biased reviews on the internet so I decided to give them a try and I'm very happy with what I received. They did not pay me to do this. They just sent this to me as a gift and I just wanted to see if I would like it and if I did, I'd share it with you guys. So these are the sandals that I bought. Now I chose, not bought, I chose. Now I chose these because they reminded me of the Fendi sandals that I really really like but I can't afford and I would never spend that much money on like some pair of shoes. But they look like this so on their website they said this is real leather and real mink fur which i normally wouldn't buy but you know this is like a one-time thing and it's really really good quality i can tell that it's super super soft and it smells like real leather i don't know if you guys know the smell of real leather but if you know you know and at first i thought they were gonna be big but they fit like a glove <laughs> i'm gonna be styling this um, I think I'm going to be wearing this tomorrow and it literally fits me perfect. It's not too small and it's not too big. It's just perfect room for comfort. And yes, I can wear this on my bed because I haven't worn it anywhere. They remind me so much of the Fendi sandals and I'm obsessed. If you guys are interested, they did give me a code to share with you all and I don't get anything from this, I don't believe. So if you guys want to check out their website, they also had boots and I really wanted like a pair of knee-high boots but I guess it wasn't available. So thank you so much both today for sending me these sandals and I'm really excited too. So yeah. You guys, I'm actually obsessed with the outfit that I ended up wearing with the sandals. It's super cute and really simple and classic and you'll definitely be seeing more of these sandals on my Instagram so make sure you check me out there. Moving right along, I got a few pieces from Sunny's and Maybelline on Nung 6 6 sale. So I ako ng Sunny's girl. They were doing like a promo Now you'll get this free teddy pouch if you spend like a certain amount of money and girl these always work on me, like I don't know why. This pouch isn't even that great, and that's to be honest. I'm probably never gonna be using this pouch, but I have all of the makeup items that I bought so that I could show you guys, okay? So from Sunny's, I got their lip treat, lip glow in two shades, and I also got their face erase micellar oil makeup remover. 
So that's that. And I've actually already tried this face erase makeup remover and I really like it. I like it because it has oil in it. Hindi siya same nung sa mga Garnier na like water lang talaga na I don't believe na nakakatanggal talaga siya ng waterproof mascara. And there's nothing I hate more than going in the shower the next morning and then you look like a panda raccoon with your eyes because of the leftover mascara. So I am pro oil makeup removers. Like, what's that? You guys know what I mean. So this gets my stamp of approval so far. I hope it doesn't break me out. I only used it around my eyes. So yeah. And usually I'm very sensitive around my eye area. Like, mahap dit siya girl if my eyes don't like it. And, and that didn't happen for this. So, like this so far. And then I have a few thoughts on their lip treat. Quick backstory. I've been really wanting to get the Happy Skin Lip Slip. Na nakikita ko sa TikTok yung mga ads na nagbudol sa inyo girl. But, it's too expensive for me right now and I can't justify spending like makano ba? 700 dollars? 700 pesos? Am I right? Or for I don't know but still it, I just remember it being kind of a little steep for one 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 product <clears throat> but I decided to try the Sunny's lip treat because it reminded me of the happy skin lip slip they might be completely different don't get me wrong i don't i haven't tried the happy skin yet, so they might completely be different but anyway i got this in the shade chai and girl crush i don't like chai first of all because it's too close to my lip color and i i know it's not supposed to be opaque it's supposed to be sheer and it's supposed to be a lip balm it's supposed to be moisturizing and stuff like that it's supposed to look really natural but it's way too close to my lip color and I just feel like it doesn't show the color doesn't show that great on my face and then this is girl crush which is what I currently have on right now and I'm completely obsessed ever since I've ever since I've been using this product I find that I've been reaching for my Carmex a little bit less because it really is moisturizing but once you eat once you drink once something touches your lips it will completely erase off it's not supposed to be a tint at least i don't think it is and it doesn't work like a tint so i'm assuming it's not supposed to be a tint it's just supposed to be like on your lips you know what i mean you get my drift so chai is not for me and girl crush is my favorite right now which is what i'm currently wearing on my lips so that's what I got from Sunny's and of course the little pouch that they have na nabula nako. Okay, now next I got a few things from Maybelline and they also had this freebie promo. Which again, this is why we're here. Nabula nako. I got the Sky High Lash Sensational Mascara because everyone and their mother keeps on talking about this, especially on TikTok. And then I got the Maybelline Matte in Sunset Affair. And I also got an eyeliner because I just needed to reach the target price to get the free item. I have already tried the Lash Sensational Sky High Mascara and it was too spider leggy for me. It was too like, it looked like I had spider legs for, eyebla for eyelashes and it didn't really curl. It, I don't know if it's supposed to curl, but it didn't hold a curl and it just made it like really straight up. So I'm not a big fan of this. I think I'll still use it because I don't want to use it. And then this is their matte lippy whatever. I think I completely fucked up on this because the color that I chose isn't good for me. It doesn't look good on my skin tone at all. It does not look good. It does not look like that on my lips. No, it looks way lighter and it makes me look like I have like chalky lips. So, but it does feel really good. Like the consistency feels nice. It's just the color that I chose, completely my fault, isn't for me. I think I'm gonna give this to my sister if she wants it. And then for the eyeliner, I literally do not like this liner at all. First of all, the brush is like a marker. It's not like the brush brush that gets really thin. Like, you see? 
and they said they claim that it's waterproof but girl this flakes off so easily i can't even deal with how easy this flakes off i refuse i'm at this point i don't believe that there's a single eyeliner that's actually waterproof and claims to be smudge proof because every single eyeliner that i've tried just straight up disappoints me so yeah i don't really like this it's the maybelline line tattoo high impact liner so i, I don't like this one <laughs> and then the freebie that that came with is Ito sila. And I don't know why I really wanted this because I'm probably never going to be using this shade. This shade is like a really neon pink. This one as well. So this is the Sensational Liquid Matte and the Superstay Ink Crayon. So yeah. Let me swatch. I don't know what my camera is like not doing a good job of showing the actual colors but I will probably never gonna I'm probably never gonna be using this and I'm probably never gonna be using this. So good job Maybelline and Sunny Snabudo Nyo sa the girl na sa mga freebie freebie vibes niyo. So and I did want to and I did want to mention I have recommended this on my Instagram before. It's the Maybelline Lifter Gloss with Hyaluronic Acid. I told you guys to get this because it's sold out everywhere and the people that resell this mark up mark it up so high but this is like one of my favorite glosses it's not sticky at all by the way this is in the shade amber it's just the perfect shade and the perfect gloss to put on any lippy it's so good so good if you guys have a chance to get this in amber i definitely suggest you get it i have one last thing to show you guys and it is i've been looking for a gym bag for a really long time i did not want a duffel bag and i also was using this rattan bag like a square bag but anyway i just really wanted like a proper usable gym bag and i finally saw like the perfect dupe for the lululemon gym bag so this is this in this color i am actually obsessed it's in this dusty blue slash purpley color and it has so many compartments that i can't even start to like describe how much i love this bag so this is her and you can put your yoga mat here so you just carry it with your yoga mat ganyan tapos see it's so like hands free it's just one bag it's like anyway yeah, it has so many compartments. These two are completely separate sa baba. But then this can open up. Mayroon siyang little button, snap, closure, whatever. And then I don't even have anything inside the zipper except for my yoga block. Because I need this. And I can just fit my whole life into this. <laughs> for example, if I'm going to the pool, I can bring my clothes, I can bring extra shoes. And yeah, and I can fit so many, so much more in this bag, but that's all I have for now. So, I love this, 10 out of 10. I'm so excited that I have this bag finally, like, can you see the smile on my face? So yeah, I think I will see you guys when I see you. I have to work out later. It's currently 4.35 in the afternoon, so I have a little bit of time to spare and yeah. I'll see you. <laughs>